now we got another what is called a school fight caught on camera. I just can't believe it. A Mobile County mom is pressing charges after she says her daughter was attacked at school. Video yeah. of the incident shows her daughter being beaten in the hallway of Alba Middle School in Viola Battery. NBC 15's Laura Barcheski spoke with both of them this afternoon and joins us live right now. Laura? Corey, the mom says that her daughter was constantly being bullied by this girl that ended up beating her up in the hallway, and the mom actually had to find out from her daughter's friend that this actually happened at school. Shout out to Brooklyn Huncho for the two dollar super chat. Say they I churn. I know, I know, right? But yeah, uh, I, I, yeah. And then I said I you look like Mickey Mouse. That's all I said. And then suddenly, this Alba Middle School team was being beaten into the tile floor in the hallway Thursday afternoon. Out of fear of more bullying, she did not want to show her face on camera. When she punched me, that made me mad, and that's when she got me from my book bag and grabbed me from the back and pushed me down on the ground and then got on top of me and punched me like seven times in the face. In the video, teachers who tried to stop the attack were even pushed out of the way and almost injured in the process. The teen girl's head was badly bruised and swollen, narrowly escaping a concussion along with several other injuries. Right here, and then my knee, right here, and then my hand, and then right here, and my shoulder. She says Viola Battery Police were called to the school that afternoon. The teen's mom, Regina Harris, says she only found out through her daughter's friend what happened, and she rushed over to the school. I was wondering why they didn't call me um, as her parent. I think I should have been notified. I think the EMS should have been notified. Um, I think the bullying and all needs to stop because it's already a, a bad situation. Harris says she took her daughter to the ER right away. The teen says the bullying was constant ever since she started going to school there just recently. It happened every day. Like, I just slid it off my shoulder, and I guess that's, like, bullying. Like, she threw pencils at me and all this, but I, I just didn't have time for it. Harris says they are pressing charges, but says she wants the school to take action and put a stop to the bullying because their family already lost one relative who committed suicide after being bullied. And I don't want her having to go to school and worry about getting beat up again or get picked on or being bullied and targeted and, you know, when you're at school to learn. That's right. I reached out to the Mobile County Public School That's System right. as well as the Viola Battery Police, but they were not able to get back to us in time for this story. Corey? Y'all is so mean. Fear, and then my knee. Y'all is really, really mean. Somebody said, well, what, well, what, what did she do? God damn right. We know these middle school kids is not innocent. Shout out to Passion for the $2 cash shop. Say, off the plantation today so I can enjoy the lie. That means you don't have to duck and dodge your boss. That's what's up. That's what's up. Appreciate you being here. Look, 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 look. Yeah, what, what, my hand. what she did? You should have fought back, baby. Right here in my shoulder. She says, damn it, and if you can't fight, better grab you, uh, them somebody around their neck and bite them and just, just hold them. Like, it's really scary if you bite somebody, especially like on their neck so it's close to their ear, and you make like growling sounds when you like, like you got the sound, like you got to act it out so they'll kind of feel like, they getting bit by a pit bull or some shit like that. It, it, I mean, if you make the sounds, it, it's, 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 it's more exciting. The Viola oh, yeah. Battery that, Police were that. called to the school that afternoon. The teen's mom, Regina Harris, says she only found out through her daughter's Riri. friend what happened, and she rushed over to the school. I was wondering why. Riri, what's up, baby? Why they didn't call me? I don't know why they ain't call you, baby, because you should, listen, you as a parent should have got the call run on down there handle that talk talk to them people at something baby um, as her parent i think i should says not std friday don't bite been notified. <laughs> i think the ems should have been notified yeah um i think the bullying and all needs to stop i'm i'm in agreement with you riri listen hey all uh a lot of people don't think about our future listen to all you young folk be careful be careful with the things that you do and the decisions that you make and the essential products you decide to use, especially at a young age, because it can, um, how do I want to say it? I don't, I don't want to offend. It, 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 it can change the trajectory. Beep, 
where I ain't got no screen of the way you look. I'm just saying, it, it, it can't. It, see, certain essential products need to be used like after 40. You know what I'm saying? After we done lived our best days and shit, we done been out here fine and sexy and, and you know what I'm saying? And now we on the down slope, so you ain't really got to keep up with the keep up, you know? I don't. Because mm. it's already a, a bad situation. Harris said, Say it look like she got a line up. Ho, 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 ho. I saw it too, Lord. It do look like she got a line up. I better go to the barber. That's what such. Oh, because it's already a, a bad situation. Mm. Harris says she took her daughter to the ER right away. The teen says the bullying was constant. Ever Shout out to her. I bet she was bad, little sub sub. I bet she used to be. Yeah. She started going to school there just recently. It happened every day. And she's a new student, so of course you're going to get picked on or something. And then if you say something back and, you know, then you're going to get picked on, beat on, and stuff like that. But no, 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 really just, I don't. Listen, to all you youngins who may be getting bullied, you got the bully back. You got the fight back. First, you tell somebody, you do all that shit there, and then people is going to get upset. The other kids are going to get upset. You is a title teller, and then they're really going to pick on you more and stuff like that. But um, if you don't think that you can beat somebody, that throat them up. I'm trying to tell that throat, that throat a change, will change the trajectory of somebody's life. I'm just saying, I'm trying to keep y'all safe. Just keep doing what y'all doing. Um, call the five. Ambulance, well, that's what they should have did. So you don't do nothing but fight back and ball up, damn it. And if you got to run, run. Do not feel bad about running because you can't fight. Everybody can't fight, especially females. Y'all shouldn't be out here fighting. But if you do, <laughs> make sure it's being recorded. I'm just saying. Moving right along, I'm not going to hold you. This is the men.